Gregory Bordigetti images Tyrell Hatton move to 18 under to open up a five-shot lead heading into the final round of the Alfred Dunhill Lynx Championship. Here, we take a look at what his nearest challengers had to say after round three. Gregory Bordy 66, 13 very pleased for sure but it's one of my favorite Lynx courses as well. I feel good on it and I knew I could do a good score there. As I say, it's a lovely course, one of my favorite ones. Of course, the old course is my favorite in the world but this one is not far away behind, I'm very pleased about my first three rounds and finishing on the old course tomorrow will be exciting, I'm looking forward to having a lovely day and I will do my best. I will fight from the beginning until the end. It's just great to be in that position on my favorite golf course in the world. And we're doing very well as a team, also. Paul Dunn 70, 11 it was tricky. I got off to a nice start birdieing one of the first two and three put a 12 for par and then I really struggled, 13 through 17 were playing really tough, back into us, strong breeze. So I can't play great but I managed to scramble some pars, and then two under was okay considering the conditions and how I played. I didn't play that well. My swing started to feel better towards the end. All in all, 70 is a decent return, so I'm not totally out of it, but I need a seriously low one tomorrow by the looks of how Tyrell is playing, I think there's going to be less wind tomorrow and if it's the same direction that means the scoring will be pretty good, so if I can try to get a few under in the first few holes, get a bit of momentum and then just try to build from that and shoot as low as I can and see what happens.